This is what happens if you spin a Lego wheel at very high speeds. That was interesting. I don't think one XL motor is enough. I might need a second battery box. Now I added another XL motor and each motor is powered off its own battery pack. Let's try this now. It appears that there is some power limiting in each battery box. I have added a lot more sections to this and I am using two XL motors. Let's turn this on. You can see that it, these motors are working extremely hard to turn this wheel. And this wheel is not turning very fast. I figured out a better gear configuration for this device. That was interesting.